That should be two match. So what you always want to do is rush your opponent and try to get their bed as fast as you can. And if they're rushing, you want to make a bad defense. And then kill them. If you kill them, finish making your bad defense. They rush. Then you want to try to go to their team. Build up. Go. Keep on going through. If they run away, you have to wait. Alright, so when they come, you want to try to double kill them if you have a good kill, like I do right now. And I'm killing them both. Once you do that, you want to break their bed. No! If it's one time, you want to hurry up and rush again. You want to keep on rushing until you can break the bed. And then if you can, double team them to kill them. And then make a de bad defense before you can. And there's only one person. You can kill him. Get the bed. Run. And run. Just run. They're coming. Oh no, I fell. Okay. So now. Since you got their bed, all you want to do is get armor or whatever you can. And just get a ton of blocks. And then you want to bridge the middle. No matter what, don't even try to kill them. As soon as you get their bad, build up. I mean, you can build up. If they're chasing you, build up. And then, if you have a lot of blocks, build to middle. You want to get all the M's. If they're trying to kill you, then you want to go to a team's base that, has, that doesn't have a bed. See, they, they'll most likely get your bed if they don't. Then I'll consider that as lucky. If you can, only if you can. Usually this doesn't happen. They might chase you. If you can, you want to go back to your base. If there's a person at middle, you don't want to chase them all the way down. Because, yes. <laughs> now, if he died... Now you want to go back to your base, if you can, or go to empty base and get your iron. You want to, you want to build to the diamonds iron. Don't risk it. If you don't have enough blocks or if it's a third ball jump, never risk it. Just go back to base and, and grind more blocks. Then what you want to do, once you get the diamonds, is get a diamond sword and balloons, and maybe if you have enough, a telepro. You want to, you want to get, if you have eight emeralds, you want to get a diamond sword, three balloons, and two telepros. And then you want to try to go to um, <clears throat> a base, try to collect iron. I went for better armor. There we go. Now, you want to build med, build to med, or go to the, if you're not too far away from your bed, you can go back to your bridge. If you don't have, if you don't want to waste your blocks, you want to go, go back to mid and get mid control, try to get, and get stacked. Once you get stacked enough, if you get stacked enough and don't get killed, then you can try to break all the beds and stuff. This this um this strategy is good for if you have a good kit or a good two v two v one kit like Cobalt, Grim Reaper, and sometimes even Yuzi. If you have M eight eight emeralds like I have, you want to get stacked it. And by crossbow, if you're good, if you're really good with bows or armor, if you're really good with PvP. I'm really good with both, but I'm going to buy armor for protection. Then what you want to do is get some bows and arrows to fight your opponent with. If you die, then this, all I'm going to say is this strategy doesn't work 100% of the time. It, only, it can only work for, it works like, most of the time, but not all the time. If there's a person at mid, where you're going, then you can. If you have, more, if you're more stacked than them, 
you can go chase them. And if they, if they don't have a bed, you can chase them all the way until they until they die. As you see, you can use your bow if you got a bow and try to bow them off. If you took main control, then he would not have that many emeralds. He will probably at max have four emeralds, and he can only buy like balloons and totally pearls. You wanna why he's in base? You wanna kill him so he, until he gets out, and so he doesn't get out. Then if he dies, then good job, you did it. Now you're you're the you're part. Oh whoa 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 wait. See, I'm not the best at bow, but I'm pretty good. That's fair. See, that's what the best kit for 2v1 is probably Cobalt Kit. But not, not all people have the Cobalt Kit because it's a level 30 Battle Pass Kit. You can also do this with no kit. You just have to be kind of good at the game. You have to at least have half a brain cell said by Tanker. You want to go at the enemy build up and you have enough blocks, you could just build to mid. Doesn't really matter. At this point, you only have two teams left. There, You can pick choices if you're stacked enough. You can either um, stack, the, stack up more and get better loot, or you can go back to base, get gather iron, and get um, bet breaking tools and break their bed. Any choice is okay, but personally, I'd like to have, um, I like longer, longer games because I think, for me, they're more fun, so I'm going to stack up a little bit. I may get a crossbow so I can blow my opponents off if they come close, or I can do extra damage, so it'll be easier to do PvP, even though I have diamond armor. So if you have armor, I'll unlock what you should, because the diamond sword... And you want to go and buy more resources. Like I said, I, I am stacked, so now I can, I probably can up bow my opponent and kill them. But right now, they're fighting right now, so I'm going to wait until the teams are weak and what bed is destroyed before I start actually killing them. And I'm just going to get stacked while they are stuck at their bases fighting. And most, they probably have iron armor. I can also bone off the bridge like that. While they're fighting, I can also gather more emeralds to get more stacked. You can get whatever you want. Since I don't, if I get bowed off once and I'm too far away from the um, surface, I, I'm going to get more emeralds to buy balloons. See, I have seven emeralds now. Now I can buy balloons and more teddy pearls. Cause if you're more stacked than players, most of the time they're just gonna run. They're close to them. So now I'm gonna buy balloons. And I, actually, you can buy a grappling hook if it's still a bit old by the time you watch this video. There you go. No, now you have a grappling hook. You can use a grappling hook. If you're good, if you're bad with the grappling hook, I will not suggest using it. I'm decent with the grappling hook. I'm not good, but I'm also not bad with it. I know a lot of people that are really good with this, but I'm the one in the middle. Oh, no, I miss. I'm not the best bower, but at least I'm kind of decent. Never, you would never want your opponent to get emeralds or, st or anything they get stacked so it'll be easier if you want to drown then you can give them emeralds or you can let them have mid control to get stacked so it could be more of a fight but since they're fighting each other that's probably not going to happen so yeah if you made it this far and everything that happened to me happened to you and you have the same catch as me then and you're just as good at pvp then you should be right here by him. Whoa. Ah. Lagging. Is that a hack? Oh, no. I'm kind of lagging right now. But if you want, while they're teaming, 
and you get stacked enough, you can, oh no, I'm lagging, I'm lagging, no, I'm gonna crash, okay, okay, I didn't crash, yes, okay, now, you can do whatever you want to, you can get more sacked, and you can wait to the front, or you can go to someone's base, get and get bed breaking tools, which is what I'm gonna do. I'm making an axe. Since I'm not gonna be using some of this stuff, I'm gonna put my stuff like that. I just gotta go. Let's go. I'll put my TNT right there, and then here we go. I'm surprised they're still fighting after 10 minutes, though. That's kind of surprising. <gasps> Ooh, I almost fell. Okay, let's go. Since I'm on mobile controller, if my stuff are too far away, I can just tap on it and then go on it. I just blow. Oh, whoa. Oh, did I even blow my? I can waste my teleport, but. Well, not really waste them, but I can use my teleport. I'm going to, but I have a box, and yes, so. Yeah. They have a big bet that they have a big bed defense. So, I you, if you don't have enough to buy TNT, you can always use this method. Go in the tinker method. Go in and block yourself in. Every time you go move, place a block above you, and then break the bed. Like I just did, and then you can mine out. Like I just did. Then, if you're stacked enough, you can finish them off. Yeah, this kid is using an auto clicker, but I have a belt crossbow, so that's not a problem. If if you deal with an auto clicker that builds up, you can always use a tele pearl. I'm trying to anti you. You can build up a little bit, and I'm gonna try to use a tele pearl. No! Why does he keep on doing that? Okay, you wanna? I'm gonna buy a lot of more Teddy Pearls, cause yes, I'm gonna try and build up a little bit more. Oh no, he teleported away. But that's not a problem, cause I can also do that. Don't do that. <laughs> It's not fun to deal with auto clickers, so though they do, it's gonna run away. Or do that. Which now I'm low, so. You can bubble them. There you go, now you killed the auto clicker. Good job. I need more blocks, so I'm gonna build. I'm gonna build. Since I have tons of. of tele pros, I'm gonna just teleport back. If that if they don't have they don't have a lot and you don't want to waste some of your telly pros no well I hope the method works for you as I I died because I made that separate choice again to do that but there you know now you know not to do that so that's how you all